How does it feel for at the back, and uh, and how do you feel about playing this week? Well, I feel I feel good. Otherwise, you know, I, I wouldn't be here. I'm not coming just to talk this trick about the President's Cup, I'm, and I get paired with him tomorrow, which is fantastic. But I've been off since Houston. I don't know, it's seven or eight weeks, and you know, I just keep waiting for it to get better, and I feel okay. Obviously, rusty, but anyone would be rusty. But I'm excited to play, and and sometimes. You play better when you're more excited than if you're playing every other week. Brad, your impressions of the course? Yeah, I, I've done a couple outings in Madison before. I don't know the course. I'll be seeing it here in 20 minutes. Um, but obviously talked to a few players, uh, and they all liked it. I know the scores were good last year. I don't know what one or, or what the average scores were, but um, I love Steve Stricker, so I can tell you that. He's been a friend forever. and. Uh, anything he does is first class, so I'm sure this is a great spot. What is it about Steve that you like or other people like so much? Um, well, for me, I can't speak for other players. He's very, very, very friendly. Uh, he's got a great family, and they're always fun to be around. I don't know if Nikki's caddy or not. He may have Aaron Rodgers caddy for him or somebody. I don't know, but he's just a, a – you know what he is? He's going to be a perfect President's Cup captain. And I keep telling him, don't be nervous, because you're just one of the guys, and um, you know, he's a big-time tour player. He's won a lot of times, and he's been out. He's 50 or 51 now, so he's been doing it a long time. But he's just uh, easy to be around. There's some good competition, not only on this range. I see a lot of uh, big faces, uh, but this whole tour is filled with golfers that still want to win. They, they have a little bit more fun, but. But is that the enjoyable part of the Champions Tour, that you still get to go out and have fun but be competitive? Well, I, I've said this every time people ask. The fa my favorite thing really is my Friday tea time. You know, today's fun. Don't get me wrong. I, don't, I, I love pro-ams, but it's the pairings. You know, so I get Stricker tomorrow and Kurt Triplett. I, I, I mean, I've been on tour 37 years. I've known both of them 30 years and 37 years. So we've played a lot. Uh, there's no surprises. And then if you play well, then you're going to get the Miguel Jimenez's and Brant Joe, who just won, and Kenny Perry's and all that. So it's a pretty studded tour. It's just a little deceiving. You know, we, we, we play in front of nice crowds. I know there will be good crowds here, but not every week. Um, but for me personally, it's it's just about the playing and, and the competition. And at 57, I really still feel like I can win, so I keep doing it. And there comes a time where I just come and, you know, I'm 25th and 30th. I, I, I'm not saying that's bad. I just can't do that. My body's not strong enough anyway, so I want to compete and I want to play against the best players. So I've got hopefully two or three more years. I keep saying that, but hopefully. Um, did you watch much of the U.S. Open last week, and what were your thoughts on, on the way that tournament unfolded, and especially all the, the buzz about the, the length of guys these days? Yeah, well, I did watch a lot of it. Um, the best thing I liked is, is seeing everyone pretty much hit drivers. But there's Jay, whose son finished, I think, fifth, Jay Haas, so he was pretty excited about it. I was texting him mostly on Sunday. But I, I, I think they missed a little bit. It just length is not a problem it's not really even a problem for us um, if we play a course that's 7200 yards we don't really get intimidated some people think you know it's long but 7700 for the PGA Tour and the US Open that's nothing it's a 510 yard hole it's a driver and an 8 iron they hit their 8 iron 170 yards and they drive it 320 um, not everyone not Jim Furyk and not you know some of the other guys but uh, for the amount of power they have, that was not much. And the fairways were a little wide, but I'll tell you, fans supported it. Uh, they had a great leaderboard with Ricky Fowler up there, and obviously Matsuyama is one of the best players in the world. So the right players were at the top. Are you going to partake in anything Wisconsin, like cheese curds or beer or anything <laughs> well, like that? Well, actually, I came with a friend who's from here. We flew out together, uh, and he's here visiting family. So. He's with Suzanne right now, and they're figuring out dinner for tomorrow night. And then we're going to go see Darius Friday night. So that Friday will be a big night for me. I, dinner's a lot of work, but then dinner and a show, that's a long day. But uh, <laughs> Darius has been a friend, so we're going to go check him out. But um, I am coming back for a Packer game against my Seattle Seahawks. But I will not have any Seahawks gear on. I won't do that. <laughs> um, but I'm coming back, I think it's September 11th, to watch. So... We may do a couple things there, but here, you know, I'm I'm a mostly golf, and we'll visit a few things, and you know, may 
And like I said, I flew in here twice, a long time ago to play uh, in a pro-am here in the night. So I've never really spent much time in there. Would you ever? Okay, thank you guys. All right.